Top of the morning, folks. I'm meteorologist Jim Howard, and I bring to you your latest WITN first alert forecast on this Tuesday, July 30th. And we're kind of focusing in on this tropical wave now, uh, well out to the uh, west or east of the Antilles right now. Uh, you can't even see much out here, but slowly uh, area of showers and storms trying to get its act together as it drives off to the east. So here's the latest projections. This is actually up to 60% now uh, probability of development here in towards the Bahamas into uh, let's say the east coast of Florida, maybe into the Gulf. Uh, still a lot of variation amongst the models on how this thing may evolve. Not showing a real powerhouse storm, but slowly a uh, tropical system trying to come together. If it does so, it would become Debbie. So we're watching the steering currents, big ridge of high pressure out over the open Atlantic and that low kind of tracking around that ridge as it does so when we get into the weekend. So here's Saturday, Sunday, this thing approaching uh, maybe uh, the east coast of Florida, give or take, could ride up the east coast if it does so. Uh, warmer water, stronger track, and certainly a track that we don't want to see here in North Carolina. Uh, if it heads off towards the Gulf of Mexico, a weaker storm headed towards the central Gulf Coast. A lot of time to watch. Uh, again, dev development possible late week into the weekend, uh, tracking that potential strength and path. Uh, enough time to keep an eye on this storm as we head in towards the weekend. Again, most of the data does keep this storm weak and generally to the south of us, but that could change. It's in our backyard, I like to say. You got to keep a close eye on it. All right, hotter, muggier, uh, near 90 this afternoon. Yesterday we hit about 84. Last nice one out there. Today we're back into the sauna, if you will. PM storm possible, uh, 5 to 10 on that south wind. And again, storm chance maybe 30, 40% later today. Got a few raindrops coming through at sunrise. This was back at 4 a.m. A little splash and dash or two headed out to the coast. You may find a wet road or two here or there as you head out, but not a lot of that. And the air temps generally starting off again in those uh, muggier low 70s. All right, those 60s gone. Check it out. Afternoon, here's midday and knocking at the 90 degree door this afternoon. Storm or two popping up, three, four, five, six, seven o'clock. Bunch of rain, no, but some scattered storms late afternoon, evening hours, and then diminishing as we hit midnight or so uh, tonight. All right, there's those low 70s headed out with that south wind at five ish. Uh, no fog out there, and air moving enough to keep the fog out. And again, those temperatures climbing to the upper 80s. This afternoon, watch the heat index tracker. Here we go, nearing 100 today. Uh, I don't think we'll be quite to 105 tomorrow, 103 ish. Uh, we get towards uh, Friday, Saturday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday in here. That's where we're pushing closer to 105 and maybe heat advisories. Uh, we've got first alert weather days Thursday, Friday, and Saturday for the heat. You'll see that on the eight day in just a sec. All right, stretch the map out, wide shot, and again, our high pressure off the coast. A storm back to the west here, the core of the rain staying to the west and north of us. There's our chance for that afternoon storm trying to get in here from the west late afternoon, evening. That'll be the deal again tomorrow. Uh, check it out tomorrow morning, quiet tomorrow afternoon. Uh, another storm or two trying to perk in. We don't see much there. I think 30% will cover us on that rain chance. All righty, get you into late week. Hot, hot, hot. Uh, that heat baking us. Late week rain chances come up a little bit Friday. Scattered storms, afternoon hours, evening hours. Saturday, I like our rain chances a little better. Here's four or five o'clock Saturday. Uh, better chance with rain as that front gets closer to the area. Late Saturday, Saturday night into Sunday. All right, rain chance today, 40% later this afternoon, 30% tomorrow. I'll go 89, 92 on the temps. And then 94, 95, 93, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. First alert weather days, heat index near 105. Dangerous heat rolling back over us. And that storm chance Friday, Saturday at 40 40. And then Sunday, uh, we'll bump that up. Better coverage of showers and storms at 60%. Ease back down to a 20% Monday with a high, dropping a few clicks under 90 degrees.